Um, so there's another zine back there called What the Fuck is Molluscum Contagiosum? And one day in June, I was sitting on the can and I looked down and there was two little bumps on my penis. And I was like, what the fuck? And I got really scared and nervous and didn't know what to do. I looked it up on the internet, which is a terrible thing. <laughs> But uh, I, I, was, I was trying to make calm, you know, avoid some of the more terrible websites. Um, and realized it was molluscum contagiosum, which is a viral skin infection. And as the name contagiosum means, it's very contagious. <laughs> I was slightly destroyed, but it wasn't that bad. I found out some other friends of mine used to have it, and they're like, oh, you'll get over it, it'll go away, you know. I went to the doctor, and she said, oh, it'll go away, don't worry. You know, it doesn't burn, it doesn't itch, it doesn't bleed, or it isn't sore. It just weirds you out a lot. Um, <laughs> so, I wrote a zine about it. <laughs> talk to people about it and be like, hey, we got to talk about this stuff. And I'm really into disclosure, like talking about your histories, talking about the things that you need to talk about with your friends and your partners. I tried to tell the folks I was living with right away, be like, hey guys, don't use my towel. <laughs> uh, Thanks, Byron. Yeah. <laughs> and just like, on top of it, I wrote a song about it so that, again, we can talk about this clearly and honestly. And I think vulnerability is really awesome. And I think it's, it's, there's this great speaker, Brene Brown, and she's got a, a video on the internet called The Power of Vulnerability. And Brene Brown is really awesome. And I was really inspired by one of her talks to write this song. So this is, this is the Molluscum song. Yeah. It actually just, I, I, I always talk too much. Um, this song, I sent in uh, this, this copy of the zine to a lady in Boston who was writing a zine called Assume Nothing. And it was all, it was a feminist perspective on STIs and sexuality. And she mostly wrote about herpes and she had other people who submitted other things. And I submitted this and she thought it was great. And so she decided she put it in the zine. I did an interview with her on my radio show for Valentine's Day. We talked about STIs for Valentine's Day, right? <laughs> <laughs> and then I just got a copy of the zine in the mail. And it was very nice to see. It was in there. She included uh, the chapter about the song. And as soon as she gave this to a friend of hers, her friend came back like the next day and said, hey, I've got molluscum contagioso. <laughs> so it's getting people to talk about it. And that's really special. That's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> That's what Velocity sounds like. <laughs> okay. I've got bumps on my cock. I've got bumps on my junk. Say that it's a virus. It's called Velocity. I treat it with tea tree. I take lots of showers. It's the cleanest I've ever been. I wash my hands ten times an hour. <laughs> I go to the doctor every other week. She sprays it with nitrogen. And when she's done, she spreads this gunk. It's called pedophilin. It's actually called pedophilin, but it didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> Spots are molluscum contagiosum. It means don't touch my cock. It's for nine months now. <laughs> While I've got these spots, we can still be sexy if you want to still be sexy. I don't need to use my cock. I can show you if you want me. I've got mouth and I've got hands. Your wish is my command. When it comes to your body, boy, know that I'm a fan. <laughs> don't let these spots on my cock and these bumps on my junk get in the way of us being safe and happy. <laughs> um. 
I only wrote it down that I'd sing one more song. So I thought this was going to go a lot.